Hi everyone, Penona Diandi here and today I will share you how to create this manipulation effect. So first add the milk box element. And then go to edit image and use BG remover to remove the background. Or if you use a new editor, just scroll down and click here and then report it to old editor okay go to edit image and then re remove the background using bg remover and then tap apply all right so duplicate uh, this page and then work on the page 2 and add a square in yellow color this yellow i mean and then increase the size a little and then send it to back all right now go to edit image and then choose a duotone and then you can choose any duotone effect here but let's try uh, just cherry and then click it once again change the highlights to white and also the shadow to white then tap apply okay now go to share go to share and then download and download the page 3 only as png add a new page in black color and then upload the png that we just downloaded here go to edit image and then choose bg remover okay and then tap apply and increase the box of this uh, frame to fit the page okay and then go to page one and copy this watermelon element and then rotate it 90 degrees to the right and send it behind the frame okay and then reduce the size and crop it so the watermelon is hide behind the yellow frame And then go to page 2 and copy the milk box and paste it here and then change the position to and place it between the frame and the watermelon and then reduce the transparency to 50 okay now change the page color to yellow And then uh, this yellow I mean and then download it as PNG page 4 only now add a new page and change the page color to white and upload uh, page 4 here and then increase the size of the box to fit the page go to edit image and choose bg remover tap apply and and then go to in edit image and choose adjust we will uh, reduce the brightness add the contrast and the saturation
we need the real watermelon to get the same color and tone so place it behind the box and let's start adjust it the brightness the contrast and the saturation contrast and saturation must be uh, added and the brightness must be lower okay so until you get the same color uh, between the box and the watermelon so i think this is the best uh, adjustment minus 56 53 and 9 and then we need to change the color of the cap just go to the page 2 and then change the background to the same color as the box and then add a square and change the color to the same color as the background and then uh, place it like this resize like this and duplicate cover the right side of the milk box and you can see like this I use three shape here square here I mean and then download this page go to page uh, 5 and then upload the PNG here resize uh, the PNG to fit the page and then go to edit image and choose BG remover so we uh, now we see that some some white color left here and we will erase it manually okay it's uh, easy to erase and then click done and apply now i want to change this blue color to red color as the color of the inside part of the watermelon so just go to edit image and then find the color mix you can choose the arctic and then click it once again to adjust it okay you can uh, add the saturation to make it more bright and to uh, adjust the hue to change the color and then tap apply now we have watermelon in a box shape Now uh, add new page and copy it and paste it in page 2. Add a yellow square and then resize like this and then rotate it to make it the head to make it has the same uh, degree with the position of the bottom part like this and then duplicate and rotate it like this and place it here all right and then group it uh, select this board yellow shape and place it almost in the middle of the box okay i think this position is good now duplicate this horizontal uh, shape and place it uh, some distance 
with the first uh, shape and also the second one is duplicate also like this and then rotate it uh, to the right maybe 3 or 4 or 5 degree from the origin position and also this uh, shape just rotate to the left maybe 4 or 5 degree and then uh, change position like this so no white color uh, show All right, and then all right, and then just remove the box of watermelon and also the cap, and download it as PNG. So we will make a frame here. Download it, and then just remove the this for shape and upload the png here okay increase the size of the box to fit the page and uh, i will change the page color to black and then go to edit image and remove background so now we have a yellow frame another yellow frame and then go to element and find the watermelon uh, cut I choose this cut watermelon and then uh, crop it and then send uh, rotate and then send it behind the frame and make some, make some adjustment here Okay, now go to edit image and choose shadow and choose the glow. And then change the color to this kind of green. Okay, you can see the color in this watermelon cut. So I will, I want to make like this. Alright, and then add the transparency to maybe 90 and reduce the size to 1. The blur is enough in 2. And then wait until it becomes a check mark. And after that, go to edit image and again choose glow and tap it once again to adjust, change the color to white or white to green this uh, this this color and then increase the size and also the transparency and reduce the blur i think two is enough and then tap apply okay now we just make the uh, skin of the watermelon and then now go to element and then add a shape in yellow color to cover all area outside the frame and then change the page color to yellow Download it as PNG. Go to page 1 and duplicate this uh, watermelon box. And then upload the PNG of the watermelon cut here increase the size of the box to fit the page and then go to edit image and choose bg remover
okay now you have the inner side of a watermelon cut now let's make the effect okay now place it here and then increase the size to fit the size of the box now crop the box and uh, adjust it to have the position like this duplicate uh, the box and place it right on the origin and then we will focus to the right side and crop the left side of the new uh, duplicate Add more little, but you have to resize it. Okay. Okay, now select them all and then group it and place it here. This is a new trick I share uh, for you. Hope you enjoy and make it for your design. So see you next video and have fun with Canva.